water. It's not only essential for life, but essential for the lifestyle we lead. In the US, water has become a fuel that we simply cannot live without. Energy production, sanitation, heating and air conditioning, food production and a host of industrial processes are all made possible through water. We use more water in one day than we do oil in an entire year. With a small, finite supply, how do we make this resource last for future generations? Forward-thinking communities have found a more efficient way to manage water resources by recycling water. Water reclamation turns wastewater into a clean, reusable resource. Instead of using drinking water, reclaimed water can be used for the large majority of our water needs, especially in industrial settings and commercial settings. By 2050, two-thirds of the US will be affected by water scarcity. High water demand is creating unnecessary strain on our natural environment through resource depletion, high energy requirements, and even watershed pollution. These factors, along with aging infrastructure, are causing the price of water to rise by 9% annually. Water reclamation helps extend the life cycle of water, replacing our linear model with a closed loop system. The Blue House fuses conventional water treatment methods with ecological principles to produce a highly efficient treatment system. The Blue House relies on plants and their root systems to create a habitat for complex ecosystems comprised of over 3,000 different organisms to break down waste. This allows our facility to treat water to higher standards in less time. As an odourless and aesthetically pleasing greenhouse, these facilities have the flexibility to be placed in nearly any environment, urban or rural. So the question is, do I believe that recycled wastewater is healthy for people to drink? I most certainly do. There are many great examples of places around the world that already are using recycled wastewater and putting it back into their public water supply because they need to. We just haven't had an instance in the U.S. yet where we need to do that. And we, because of that, there's the perception that somehow recycled wastewater can't be cleaned to a level that we want to put, that we want to drink again, when actually the technology is completely there. This is totally a perception versus reality issue, and it's about public education and awareness. Um, and it's also just not something you want to think about, but it is water. It's just water.